up. Canizero at second, Sean Potke at first. 0 oh, 2 pitch, curved him up, swung out and missed. Strike three. Three. have been playing very well this season. Curveball got him. Called third strike. Have it. Tony Ramirez in the 3 2 pitch. Hopper up the middle. Fielded by the shortstop behind the bag at second. Strong throw to first in time, and Ramirez is erased. Listening to the broadcast, just text me. He's listening to the game live on the Lafayette channel. 12.40 a.m., New Iberia Lafayette. This one's ripped down the line into the corner. Extra bases for Boudreaux. He's the 1-1 one -one pitch, runner going. Fly ball, well struck, right field. Boudreaux heading back. The right fielder gets underneath it, makes starting lineup. Who's batting under 297. Here's a fly ball, straight away center. Hitter Crohan, 3-0. UTSA line shot right field, that's trouble. Base hit, and it gets over the head of the right fielder, Baker. But he was able to field it quickly. Short lead off the bag at first base for Crohan. Coach Jones talked about it in the pregame as the pit left-handed hitter at the plate. Line drive left field, this is trouble. Get a drop in, Crohan's in. Garner comes around third, he's gonna score two. And Make it a one-run ball game. Good right side. Second baseman Canizero picked it. On to Potke at first base for the out. Three, two roadrunners, bottom of the sixth inning. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Line shot right field on the run. Diving effort by Wellborn, and the ball is going to roll. The right fielder, Baker, backed it up. And Pot pitches, I would assume they may not. As here's a sharply hit ball right side. Nice effort by Canizara at second. He fielded it in shallow right field, close to first base, and they finally got him. And up this afternoon at second base. Sean Potke at first. Ground ball right side. Woodson takes it on one hop. Good throw to first. One away. This season, they will join Conference USA next year. Ground ball, third base. Up with it is Canizaro on to first, and that will end the inning. 3-2 pitch, swung through, struck him out. Huge K for Alex Bio. 0-2. Oh, the 0-2 oh, pitch to Baker. Ground ball, first base. Pot K fields it, takes it himself. 0-1 oh, pitch, ripped it. Fair ball down the left field line, and that's going to bang into the corner. Extra bases for Pot K. He's in it too. Riley Goods finally going to fish it out into that. Deep left field corner down by the hack shack to center field. Here's the 1-0 pitch, base hit center field. Ganizero steps on third. He comes around and scores. Brings Berrios with his third RBI of the season. 2-0 Tulane. An action on Wednesday night, 7 p.m. This one lifted into shallow right. Woodson, the second baseman, heading out. Called off by the right fielder, Berrios, who makes the catch. Down the right field line. 0-2 pitch, line shot, left center field, base hit. Boudreaux is aboard with a base hit. So Brandon singles to left center field. A 3-2 pitch, swung on, and struck him out. So he's not batting 300, he's pretty close to it. And the ball nearly kicked away, they're gonna take a throw down to third, and he had a late break, gone. The 2-2. Swung on, got him. Punch out number four on the afternoon. The 1 0 pitch, fly ball, right center field. On the run is Berrios and Boudreaux, and Boudreaux's going to run it down and make the catch to end the inning. I'm at Devlin Fieldhouse. 8 6 1 wave for tickets. 0 2 pitch, Carthon fights that one off and gets it into center field for a base hit. Well, he was jammed, and it's a good piece of hitting there by Richard Carthon. In Jabot, kick and the pitch. The 3-2, got him. A rock and roll strikeout. Fox with a 3-2 count. The pitch from Jabot, got him. 3-2 pitch, swung on and struck him out. Standard hitter at the plate. The 1-2 pitch from Jabot, swung through, struck him out. Garza's a strikeout victim. Third K of the afternoon for Ian Jabot and give him a save. Tulane wins it. For Jabot, it's his third save of the season. Napoli delivers. Fastball strike three called on the outside corner at the knees. And oblique, one, two, curveball. Strike three called. 
First pitch to Middleton is ripped down the left field line. That is hooking, but it's going to stay fair. Down into the left field corner, and Middleton will cruise into second with a double. Nice start. Boudreaux got it down. That's a beauty. Third base side. Correa bobbles it. Everybody's safe. He's reached base in a 571 clip. Nowhere to put him. High fly ball to left. That's got a shot, folks. Back is good. He's at the wall. That is gone. It's a grand slam. Grand slam, Garrett Canizero. And it is five to nothing. Clear them all, touch them all. Home run number two for G2. Bat off, pitch, curve, strike three called. Another K looking. Fastball, you gotta be kidding me. Strike three called. <laughs> Inside corner. Up the middle. Middleton behind second. Gotta hurry. Got him. Stretch, pitch, runner going. Chop to the left side. That's a base hit. Woodson's gonna keep going to third. Finally a hit and run that worked. <laughs> Almost. There's a high pop-up. Back of first. Second baseman drifting, and it's going to drop. It is going to drop. Two runs are in. Here comes another run. Boudreaux scores. It's a three-run pop fly double in shallow right field. Underway. Deep short. Middleton backhand sets himself. One hopper to first, and this time Potke got it. Liner to second. You're doubled up, son. See ya. That's that. Two for four is Correa. And that's going to do it. Pop up, shallow left. Out is Middleton. Calling him off is Crohan. This one belongs to the Waves. So, solid, solid effort on this Sunday. St. Patrick's Day in New Orleans as Tulane cruises to victory.